Hello everyone and for today I will show you how to completely install custom icon pack with 7TSP patcher. In description below of this video you will find download link for 7TSP and download link for custom icon pack Alien War. This icon pack is for Windows 10. To download from DeviantArt you need to make account. Also the download link for custom icon pack will be from Mediafire. Here in the folder we have 7TSP, we need to rename this to the .exe file. And now I will turn off the antivirus. If the antivirus is on, the antivirus will stop the 7TSP to do patching of the custom icon pack. Also the important thing is to run this as administrator. Here in the 7TSP just go to the add a custom pack. Now go and look for the custom icon pack Alien War. This is the preview of the custom icon pack. Now go to the options and check this box which says to create a restore point. Click OK. Now click on start patching and now I will speed up the video. Here do not click no, it is really important to click yes after the patching. So I will click yes here and I will be back after restarting my PC. I am back and you should get the same message as me. The system has been patched, you can click ok here. And now I will open the window explorer and you can see that I have a completely new custom icon pack on my windows 10. Now if I go to the control panel, if I set the icons to category you can see that they are all changed to the custom icon pack. Folders are also changed. Okay, now, after some time, if you want to restore the custom icon pack that you have just installed, how to restore to the Windows 10 default icons, simply run the 7TSP as administrator and also turn off the antivirus. Mine is already turned off. Here, just click restore and choose first option and click OK. Click yes here. Now the 70SP is restoring to the Windows 10 default icon back. Now here, again, it is really important to click yes, so after restarting PC you should get this message, the system has been restored. And now if I open the window explorer after I click OK here, I should get the default windows icons on my windows 10. And that's it, as you can see, the folders are default windows icons. And everything is back to the normal. 
now I will show you my now I will show you my version of the windows and that's it for this tutorial thank you for watching and see you next time bye